You may ask sometimes why only one wheel of your snowblower is turning. And one is free spinning. This is why. You'll notice that the cotter pin is going through just the axle and not the rim. On this particular model, there are two holes. The cotter pin was originally through this hole right here, and the rim was spinning on the shaft. To make both wheels turn, you simply remove the cotter pin and stick it through the second hole, or the inside hole. Be sure that the outside hole is showing still, or else the axle may slide side to side. Now that the pin goes through the rim and the axle, you'll get both wheels turning. The reason for this hole on the outside it's so that in the off season you can move this around nice and easy because one wheel is still being driven and the other spins freely that way it spins I hope this answered your question.